millions of Americans are facing financial hardship due to rising consumer prices, as the level of inflation remains at its highest level in more than 40 years. Recent data reveals that over 50 million Americans are struggling to meet financial obligations, leading to a significant increase in credit card defaults, auto loan delays, and student loan non-payments. This surge is pushing credit card debt to an all-time high, with subprime borrowers experiencing default rates of nearly 9%. Additionally, repossessions are soaring, reaching over 20,000 daily, highlighting the economic strain faced by many. The economic impact is evident in the broader context, with repercussions for small businesses and the banking sector. Small businesses, already grappling with challenges, are likely to face increased difficulties as consumer debt rises. Unsurprisingly, inflation woes affect lower income groups disproportionately. While it's relatively easy to shrug off price increases when it only reduces the amount of money left at the end of the month, it is much harder for people who struggled to make ends meet even before prices started surging. Inflation pressure has even caught up with high-income households though, as 40% of those with household income above $90,000 now say they're facing financial hardship in face of inflation, up from just 29% in November 2023. The share remains much higher for low-income households, however, where 74% now experienced severe or moderate economic issues due to rising prices. People who are struggling financially frequently feel under constant strain and stress. One's mental health can be negatively impacted by worrying about money, bills and debt management, which can worsen anxiety and despair. This is the reason financial literacy is so important. It enables people to make wise decisions and get through difficult times with greater ease. A survey has revealed Americans need an average salary of $74,688 to feel financially secure. Workers in dangerous jobs expressed a slightly lower average income need at $73,409, followed by individuals with medical conditions $68,498 and low-income individuals $51,728. It is also discovered that financial struggles are significantly impacting the mental health of people with medical conditions. A significant 58% of Americans shared that they face severe mental health effects due to financial challenges. However, more than half of low-income individuals, about 56%, and those working high-risk jobs, around 52%, also reported the same. Many American families are having economic difficulties paying their bills on time. Layoffs and wage reductions, among other economic challenges, made an already difficult position much more difficult to handle. Loss of job. As of 2023, the financial burden on American households has intensified, reaching a staggering total outstanding consumer debt of nearly $14.9 trillion. This includes a variety of different types of debt, including mortgage loans, auto loans, student loans, credit card debt, home equity lines of credit, personal loans, and retail credit card debt. Breaking down the numbers, the average American bears a debt burden of approximately $92,727. Families trying to escape the bonds of debt are facing an overwhelming challenge as a result of this heavy debt burden. High interest rates coupled with insufficient funds for savings compound the challenges, making it increasingly difficult for individuals and families to achieve debt-free financial stability. High cost of living. Different parts of the country have vastly different costs of living. Families residing in states like Hawaii, Washington, D.C., New York, California and Massachusetts face much higher living expenses on average than those in states like Mississippi, Kansas, Oklahoma, Alabama and Tennessee, according to the Missouri Economic Research and Information Center. For example, the median income homeowners need to live comfortably in Washington, D.C. is $142,230 per year dollar. Conversely, the median income to live comfortably as a homeowner in Memphis, Tennessee is just $63,595 per year, rising to $69,331 for renters. With life getting more expensive, Paying bills has become a tough task for many American families. In response, people are joining together and going on strikes to speak up about the financial pressure they're feeling. These strikes are a way for families to make their voices heard and highlight the difficulties they face in dealing with the rising cost of living. 
loss of job. According to the latest data from the Pew Research Center, the economic landscape in the United States has taken a toll on a substantial portion of the population. Since the beginning of the year, over 40% of Americans or a member of their family have faced the grim reality of pay reductions or job losses. These economic challenges have triggered a cascade of hardships for households across the nation. In the distressing year of 2023, the unemployment rate reached an alarming peak of 14.8%, breaking previous records and underscoring the severity of the economic downturn. The ripple effects of this unprecedented job crisis are felt keenly, with 27% of individuals who experienced income disruption or job loss resorting to seeking assistance from food banks. Additionally, another 10% turned to charitable organizations in their quest for financial relief. These startling statistics highlight the extent of the financial hardships that a sizable segment of the American populace faces and highlight the pressing need for comprehensive economic assistance and rehabilitation programs to lessen the financial pressures placed on struggling families. Low pay. Simply having a job doesn't guarantee an easy time paying the bills for many Americans. Shockingly, over 61% of employed individuals in the United States are finding it increasingly challenging to meet their financial obligations. The situation is exacerbated by the fact that a significant number of American workers are earning the federal minimum wage, which remains at a meager $7.25 per hour in 2023. Even when working a full 40-hour week at the minimum wage, gross earnings amount to just $290, translating to a monthly income of $1,160. This paltry income makes it nearly impossible for families to cover basic living expenses, such as housing, groceries, and healthcare. As a result, many hardworking individuals find themselves caught in a cycle of financial strain that highlights the pressing need for fair wages and improved living standards. Medical bills. A recent survey from the Commonwealth Fund finds that many people are struggling to pay their medical bills and have accumulated medical debt over time. In fact, 41% of working-age Americans, or 72 million people, have medical bill problems or are paying off medical debt, up from 34% in 2023. If you add in the 7 million elderly adults who are also dealing with these issues, a total of 79 million Americans have medical bills or debt problems. While these difficulties are rising across income brackets, families with low to moderate income appear to be burdened the most. According to the survey, over half of working age individuals with annual incomes under $40,000 said they had trouble making ends meet or were in debt from medical costs. Energy bills. As winter approaches, the financial strain on households is intensifying, especially with the rising costs of energy. Approximately 20% of Americans have found it increasingly challenging to pay their energy bills in full at least once during the year. This escalation in energy costs significantly contributes to the financial burden experienced by individuals and families across the nation. The repercussions of soaring utility expenses are reflected in the sacrifices made by more than 28% of Americans. To ensure they can afford their energy bills, a significant portion of the population has had to make compromises in essential areas, such as skipping meals or forgoing necessary medications. A distressing reality emerges as 18% of households admit to maintaining their houses at temperatures that are either unhealthy or unsafe. Families are faced with the difficult decision of prioritizing basic necessities over maintaining a comfortable and safe living environment. The Winter Fuels Outlook 2023 report projects varied cost increases based on heating sources, shedding light on the differentiated impact on households. Households relying on natural gas are anticipated to face a substantial 30% increase in expenditure compared to the previous winter. Similarly, those using electricity for heating will experience a 6% rise. However, the most significant cost hikes are predicted for households using propane or heating oil, with propane consumers facing an alarming 54% increase and heating oil users confronting a steep 43% rise in prices. Financial challenges experienced by a large segment of the population during the winter months are clearly highlighted by the battle to combine energy bills with other demands economic consequences and impact on banks. The financial difficulties faced by many Americans have put banks in a tough spot, leading to increased risks and a decrease in lending. 
the central bank's decision to significantly raise interest rates, hitting a high of 5%, has played a part in the struggles faced by institutions such as Silicon Valley Bank. This has had a direct impact on their investment portfolios, causing setbacks. Adding to the challenges, the rates of people failing to repay commercial loans have surged to a 30-year high, creating a concerning situation for both large and small banks. The potential ripple effect is not only affecting the banking sector, but is also spreading across the broader economy. Businesses, worried about a possible economic downturn, are becoming more cautious, resulting in a reduction in the number of loans they are willing to offer. An important problem is the sharp increase in commercial loan default rates. The already unstable banking system is under significant pressure because of this increase, which has reached levels not seen in three decades. As a result, banks are forced to reassess their lending strategies, leading to a reduction in the availability of loans for businesses and individuals alike. The economy, still recovering from the shocks of recent times, is now facing additional headwinds due to the tightening credit conditions. Amidst the prevailing challenges in the economic landscape, there is growing speculation about an impending wealth transfer set to unfold in 2024 and 2025. The plight of small businesses, which constitute a substantial portion of the United States economy, is becoming more pronounced, with many teetering on the brink of bankruptcy and closure. To address the ongoing bill strike in America, a comprehensive strategy is needed, encompassing financial education, government intervention, and targeted relief programs. Initiatives should include widespread financial literacy programs to empower individuals, coupled with government measures like economic relief and policies targeting the root causes of rising living costs. Debt relief programs, job creation, and affordable housing initiatives can directly alleviate financial burdens while collaboration with financial institutions and community support networks ensures a holistic approach. Comment down below on what you think and leave a comment if you find value in the content we do on this channel. Hit the subscribe button for all the latest updates and we'll see you in the next video.